guys welcome to another tutorial first of all I want to thank you for the 75 likes and um, yeah I'm really yeah really happy with it um, yeah um, let me look if it works yes it works nice okay um, I'm gonna show you how to make uh, materials like that my own material pack uh, it's coming out very soon I guess so stay tuned so yeah, um, this is it, what we're gonna make today, so let's create a new file, start with the render settings, um, 1280 by 720, uh, resolution up to um, 100, I don't know why but it makes it better in my opinion, uh, geometry to best, um, 4 four times 4 uh, to 2 times 2 and make this to around 12 right click in here so you have all that and I only use sharper filter and put it on 8% that's what I got and when you have this here you can do it like uh, ctrl D or go to um, um, let me find it Um, yeah, here uh, um, it's project settings. That that's what it was, and you put um, yeah, you uncheck linear workflow, so like that, and then you have then you have it already done. You. Uh, yeah, you get your Lightroom like I have. Um, then we're gonna start making the text, mo text. We put uh, just uh, for fun this middle 60. Choose no, no, no. Wait, wait for that. Caps. I put it on eight by two. And again, eight by two. Then I copy this and make the two to three, and make this forty. And by clicking and holding shift, and then dragging, you can uh, drag it in ten centimeters. So it's easy to do. So yeah, now it's here. You do, do like that that little turn so it look kind of better like that then we're gonna choose the font I will choose a red circle because yeah why not pretty nice font okay let's make the material themselves um, double click here um, if you can see I got this one but normally you have that one but I always use per GI uh, because it will make it better and I change it by uh, preferences let me show you guys that really fast um, it's in um, here um, by material preview and then material default project and use then spur GI like I have it yeah it's just for f for yeah I don't know uh, first of all gonna ch uh, you have to check diffusion reflection and bump um, let's start with the diffusion and put them on one two three one two three three and you have to color go to diffusion and make this 85% and yeah go like here and make a noise open a noise and make this a little grayish I don't know why I use that but yeah okay um, make this that one <laughs> wavy turbulence and make this around 350 yeah 300 
Yeah, I like Trion. So, <clears throat> sorry. Um, yes, that's it for this one. Then we go to Reflection. And there you can um, make them all 1, 2, 3. I'm doing it like um, 1, 2, 3. Tap, tap. So it will be in the next box. Um, make the... Um, yeah, add an image. Um, I don't know where my image will be. I will... No, 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 no. Wait a minute. It can be hard to find. Okay, uh, guys, I will see you back when I found my image. Welcome back. I found my texture. It's over here. Now you have to uh, make the mix strength around 75 and um yeah there was some that was it i think okay then we go to bump make uh, the no you go over here you click and hold it and then you press ctrl and you're dragging it over to bump and place it on the texture yeah this thingy and you yeah you leave it then you make it 70% and that's what it was for um, yeah the bump then we go to specular um, we make this like 65 percent um, 35 and something like 8 and make the colors here also one two three yeah i think that's something yeah that's the material and then we call it iron iron and we have the iron now we do ctrl c v and we go to color and we make it a nice purplish color uh, like here 90 by 2010 I like even numbers so by uh, pressing it and hold it you go to reflection and you do the same to specular and we call it purple now it isn't done yet uh, because we have the wrong texture so we go over here we go to my images here or let me go to my other images um, oh my god I have so many shit I can't um, backgrounds yeah I have too many here it is you open it up and say no you will place also in the bump And then you have your materials. It it isn't yeah that hard, but it's pretty okay to do. Oh, uh, be sure to put the pro pro projection on cubic and make it seamless. And now if you're gonna look, we have pretty dope materials, right? I think I fucked this up. Metal. Yeah, you have to make this a metal, and then will it look better, way better. Okay, let's render it again. Yeah, that's how I create my materials. It's yeah. It's, it's, it's pretty nice. You can always change it or edit it, but it isn't that hard as the most of you guys will think. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching my tutorial. Um, I hope you I see you guys in the next tutorial or at my next intro. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Adios.